Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back into the CXWI Cup. It's the second round. Winners of this going through to the semi-finals. I'm at about one, being joined here by JSR. Woo! And um... Wow! What can I say about this? I don't know why you're so high pitched right now. Yeah, it's just... Well anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we're kicking it off. Jack Stanbridge against Reptile. Should be an interesting matchup to say the least, because these two could pretty much be favourites to win. Well, of course, Jack Stanbridge. But if you he, has, he has burnt the bridge. Well, not just burnt it, but blew it up with the Neo Covenant. Following the um, recent events on Melee. Yeah, anime. In which Jack, I will say this again. To be honest, I know Arbiter can be a very touchy individual, especially when it comes to the relationship between the elites and the brutes. So, clearly he did what he thought was justice. But I, then Jack decided to get involved in that. But then again, I don't... That's just Jack for you, and I don't know what it is about Jack. He, I think him and Arbiter, I don't think they're ever going to find a moment when they're not at each other's throats. Speaking of person, people who tend to get into your throats quite a lot. Well, no, that's more Zoloark than Reptile. But Reptile is, if you get the joke of the... Well, no, if you got the joke of what I said. Yes, I got the joke of what you said, and a certain someone has pissed me off. What, Reptile? Well, more Reptile and someone trying to pose as Zora. I'm not going to name names, but... Well, anyway, here is Reptile and, um... You didn't let me You know, there's been a lot of, um... You didn't there's let been me... a lot of talk. I'm just going to just put this out there. But... The photos that are being sent to the Brotherhood of what Zoloark is doing to Lucario... Supposedly, it is Reptile who takes those photos. That's the rumor that's going around however that's not been confirmed backbreaker there this should be quite an interesting matchup if i had to choose who could win this match i would have to go uh, well i can't say former world champion because both these superstars have been former world champions over the years so jack a former cxwi world champion reptile the first ever mcaww world champion but it's quite a tough match to call. Two former world champions facing off against each other. You cannot really ever call those sorts of matches. But this one, on current form-wise, you would go Jack Stanbridge. I sort of have an agreement with you. Of course, he did recently pick up a win over ME, who we'll be seeing in a later semi-final against Blaziken. But of course, you've got to give the assist of that to Dark Forge. Yep, so this is why... But then again, Reptile hasn't had a bad run either. Of course, he picked up a win over... Of course, as we remember, he picked up the win over Lucario at Hyperlink. And then he was successful in the first round. So... And yeah, they also picked a... up a win over Blaziken and Mewtwo as well. Well, it was Zoloark who got the roll-up on Mewtwo, which but that, shocked that technically... people. But technically, that still counts as a win because it was a tag team match. Yes, it was. A tag team match! Oh, stop that in the face. This is why these, this match is going to be quite interesting to call. Because momentum oh. will pretty well, much... Momentum plays behind anything, but also these two, they are pretty similar styled as well. Well, I would say similar, but they both show a degree of high flyness and technical ability. But Reptile is more the high flyer. And Jack Stanbridge is more the technical style. Also, if you go by experience also you, edge, have, but also, you have elements of martial arts and brawling. Jack Stanbridge being the brawler, Reptile being the martial arts. Oh, nice done there. There's one key factor that would pretty much sum this up, that who should win this match, and that is experience. That would go to Reptile. Well, it's Reptile. He's been in, um, he was in CXWI at the beginning of CXWI, and then was released shortly after he was eliminated from the first ever CXWI Cup. He would then return during um, during Lucario's oddly religious phase. Because right now, 
not just the brother, but many people are now saying a prayer for Lucario. So much time, but it's kind of becoming a um a thing among most of the roster. I yeah, actually done there's that. A hashtag going around right now. Well, then again, I'd have to set. I can't really blame them. I mean, there's been a, a video circulated of um what Zoloark recently did, and um. Well, it's certainly gained a lot of controversy. Well, there's also a situation because Shadow is now completely nightly torn to side with the base on this sort of situation involving Lucario. Well, Shadow actually hasn't really made that much of an address of it. I'm aware that Shadow is going to be having talks to Zoloark. However, I have no clue well, we got, when we got he's going to Cover here. Ooh. Almost. But of course, Shadow, he's been having other... The COO, Shadow, he's had other things to be dealing with. The amount of... The criticisms of corruption in management. Or not just... Not, well, not really in management, but just at Shadow himself. Has yep. been Shadow's priority. And so far, he's made it clear he will punish those who blame him for corruption. Then again, he said he'd do that to me. And I whoa, 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 whoa. Look at Jack. Giga Impact. Giga Impact. Just out of nowhere as well. You didn't see that coming. Yeah, right now, Jack. Uh-oh. He's going to go for it again. Again. Because Reptile's resilient. He will not give up without a fight. That's two. He's going to go for it again. Oh, my God. He's again. Going for it again. Jack has been studying up Reptile. He's resilient. He's again there. I think. Is he going to go? That's three. Reptile getting back up. He's going for it again! Oh. I don't know why I'm talking like this! Stop Jesus. saying like this! You see right now, he's going up again! His arms look again! That's five! Five! Why the hell? Impact! Come on up here and he hooks the leg! Two. Count to a hundred! Jack is through! Jack! It progresses to the semi-final. So it proves my point that momentum is key. Jack certainly building the big momentum in that one. And a very good matchup as well. Well, Jack is the first individual to progress to the semi-final. However, he can be taking on any of the other five semi-finalists. It's not drawn to who's drawn what he's what that is completely random but here it was the final giga impact and that saw the end of reptile oh yeah but what a match to call this one this one was quite a good match it's probably set the standards for what's to come up in the tournament Absolutely. Good match well, so Jack, for Jack progressing to the semi-final and... Oh, wait a minute! Oh, 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 here we go again. Here we oh, go no! again. And Jack was ready this time. Oh, of He's course. He's two. Well, of course, again, they had a conflict on melee. Also involving Sebulba. And then, of course, Silver would end up getting it. Of course, Silver and Jack, they're actually good friends. So, well, they've been teaming up lately yeah. on the live event, so you got to say with that. Oh, crap. Oh, oh look at that Arbiter. Classic Arbiter. I'm not going to do a Michael Cole here and say vintage. Oh, well, you just did. Fuck you. And in that, oh. Shot the old crap. Down a Singapore Cade. Well, I was, I was saying this. I was about to say this has been a clean match. I wasn't expecting the Arbiter. Well, it was a clean match. But the issues between Jack and the Arbiter! Ah, oh, that kick to the skull there! So, but we'll be seeing Arbiter later in the semi final against Zinyak! But will we see a clean match there either? Because remember, it's Zinyak! This could be quite an interesting next second round to the tournament. And I'm gonna well, say, Jack there, but he's this made, should he's be very interesting. Jack through the next round, but he's down it out now!